Shea Bear 1000 here. You guys remember us checking out this DVD player with the surround sound? We got this um, old DVD player um, and CD player. Supposedly it don't work. We're going to hook it up in the garage today. I got to get up in the attic and I don't like going up there ever. Okay guys, so what we've got here, we've got this uh, DVD player, it's got surround sound with it. And I've got all the speakers and subwoofers, but I think I'm going to substitute the two front ones for these two. There's two in each one of these, so I'm going to get them put up there. And I'm also going to add a subwoofer. I'm going to add the Sony subwoofer. I'm not sure how many watts it is, but back here is actually a cooling fan. It's got to have a cooling fan to keep it going. So what I got to get up in the attic for is I'm going to run some wires up along that pipe there. And up where that pipe goes into the ceiling, the, that's the, uh, the wires that's going around that pipe. Um, those are for the uh, doorbell. So I can get the wires up through there pretty easy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put one of these speakers here over there, one on the other side. This center one here is going to go in the center if I can if it'll fit without hindering the door if not I may have to go up higher than the the spring and then I'm gonna put a speaker there and one over here so these this one I can run over it's no problem I can run it right over because this DVD player is gonna be sitting here uh, this is probably gonna go on top now this was not this not gonna fit up there because of the light so I'm not sure where I'm gonna put that uh, I don't know. We'll just have to see um, about that. But and then the other that wire from from that will come over this way. But like I said, the center one's going to have to come through the ceiling. That one over there's going to have to come up through the ceiling. And same way with this one, so I can bring it bring it over, and I'm going to bring the wires out over here because I don't like wires running everywhere see I don't even like that up there but it's all I can do with it right now uh, that white one that's coming down at an angle that's just uh, that's a cable wire cable coax so I'll be getting that out of there uh, I got a flag to put up here I'm gonna put a checker flag up there so I'll probably take it out then I'll just pull it up through so I gotta make some holes I'm gonna run in wires I'm not gonna get you up in that attic I've had you up there before and it's probably 120 to 130 degrees up in there. I know one day in the winter time I was up there and it was 97. So let me get these wires run and then we'll start hanging the speakers and stuff.
guys, so there you go. I didn't uh, film like up in the attic running that wire across there and all that stuff. I did show you an idea of hanging the, the center speaker. That was the hardest one to hang. The other one's just typical. I mean, wasn't, wasn't much to them. Now the wires on this one over here. See the wires there along that wall? Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to zip tie them together and then I'm going to I'm going to take, because I've got over here too, I've got this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some PVC pipe, you know, like that stuff there, only not off of that, of course. I've got some around here, and I'm, I'm just going to use that table saw there, and I'm going to cut it in half, and I'll run the PVC pipe. Right, I'll run the wires right behind the PVC pipe so you won't you won't see all them wires you'll just see it'll look something like that over there a little more cleaner look um, and these wires here coming down from my plugs and stuff um, I've got over here in this cabinet I have some um, wire loom so I can, I'll paint it white and then I'll put all them in a wire loom so that'll all be cleaned up. But, so I've got all together, let's see there's five there because each one of them has two speakers in them. So that's four, that's five. I've got six, seven. I've got the subwoofer there. And I've got that subwoofer down there. It just absolutely would not fit up here right. I could have moved it over here. The only thing I don't like about this is how far out it sticks. But, you know, it is what it is. It'll be fine. I do have the remote. We found the remote for that. So the remote works. Um, this wire here is for my phone. For jamming. Um... So, yeah, let's set you up here, and we'll turn it on. I got some royalty-free music. I uh, can't play any ACDC or anything like that, because it'll make me cut that part out, which kind of doesn't make sense. If I cut it out, then you, you know. So let's go ahead, and let's play some music here. Nancy, I just seen you uploaded a video. I'll check it out after a bit. Okay, that's Nancy Jones. Go check her out. All right, so it's all running through the DVD player. I've got a bunch of old CDs in there. Like I said, I can't play them because of uh, copyright. I have no strikes on me, so I'm going to keep it that way. So, I don't know where my ashtray went. Alright, let's go ahead and let's put some music on here. This is just YouTube stuff, so... It's only going to sound as good as this mic and what you're listening to it with, but you get an idea. Sounds pretty good in this garage. Let's get another one on here.
gonna have to lengthen that screw apparently. <laughs> can really crank it out now man so I need to go over and hang that speaker back up I guess you can say that speaker couldn't hang <laughs> get it got a nice little dent in the screen now but it is what it is those Sony's really kick ass and like I said, the rest of them are Yamahas. I've got the other two right here. The other two Yamahas, which I was going to put up there. But as you heard, those ones kick ass pretty good. So there you go, guys. Like I said, sorry I didn't film at all. But uh, I did take a reading up in the attic yesterday. And I was going to film that. And I forgot because Monkey came home. And once she got home... I was done. I was done because I spent all day up in there because I had to climb through from that hole all the way across to over here up where it goes in at. So yeah, I had to get, and these are gabled roofs, so once you get back in here it gets real thin on you, you know, so uh, yeah, so that's pretty good. So, anyway guys, I can jam now. We can have a lot of fun. We can have some fun. <coughs> I can karaoke through that thing too, so that would be cool. Um, I got Monkey out here helping me clean up. We're soaring through stuff. Like all this stuff down here. All, all that's, well, that's trash. But all that stuff over there is selling stuff. I got to go through those two big bins over there. There's going to be some selling stuff items in that. And I still got to get 90% of this stuff is selling stuff. Um, I decided I'm going to keep these two saws. That's why we're selling ours, our Ryobi, because that's a that's a good saw right there. And this is a good saw here, the table saw. I just got to uh, put another piece of wood on the bottom. So I don't know if it's been wet or what, but it's just crumbling apart. You know, it's just like crackers. You know what I mean? So, anyway guys, uh, sorry I didn't film at all, but like I said, I did film the one, so you get an idea, that was the hardest one. Um, you'll see me going up and down, I'll fast forward through that. Um, like I said, those wires will be bundled together and they'll be somewhat hidden, so. Because, you know, to run that up into the attic to come over, I think it's four feet, and then down, you know, for me to climb back in there, it's just not feasible. So, you know, and it would use a lot more wire. The more wire you use, um, you don't get as crisp of a sound. And this this sounds pretty good just for an old, you know, they had this in their living room, um, but they had different speakers hooked up to it. And this is kind of what you would consider a big room. Um, so that's why I didn't put the the rear speakers back there because you know this is where I'm going to be working right here so this is the equivalent to a small room so it sounds pretty good I'm pretty happy with it I like it I like to jam always have music's always been a big part of my life so and I can also turn it up and down here if I want um, so yeah it's a uh, 
it cranks. I like it. Oh shit, that's not royalty free. There we go. <laughs> Yikes. Alright guys, so anyway, again, thanks for watching. Sorry I didn't film it all, but you get the idea. It's been out here two days doing this, so like I said, monkeys helped me today get this stuff sorted. And I got my checkered flag. I'm, I want to get hung up today. And um, so yeah, the old, that old speaker over there couldn't hang. <laughs> Don't forget to check out Monkey 1000. Shaper, myth man, legend, golfer now, man. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Appreciate it. Y'all be safe. Bye-bye and take care.